it is season three and the kardashian jenner fans have already tapped out of their reality tv series as a matter of fact so many of them are now saying this series should have ended on e-news and they should have went out with a bang because at this point in time even though the little trailer that they have is giving you know excitement it's giving sadness their followers are saying they're simply not buying into it because it's just it's just gonna be the same as the other seasons before however there's a comment that i've seen if you know a few times and that is people are happy that scott disick is coming back now when we said scott was coming back because the show was just dry it was not delivering and many people found scott disick entertaining that is what the media was saying because i don't watch the show i haven't watched that show in well over 10 years maybe more right so many people assume that they were going to bring back scott because scott was definitely very funny and he added life to the show because if kim is not fake crying for chloe like listen did you guys saw how kim got exposed with those fake tears i think they're called gif tears or whatever tears you can correct me in the comment section so if you remember when she was crying about chloe and tristan being cheating cheating on her consistently embarrassing chloe he was exposed to be crying fake tears now um what many people are saying is that the storyline is just the same and you can see that it's forced it's made up and they don't appreciate the fact that when they're watching the season the series whatever they're saying that happened in the past they could go back to, go back to that clip and see that what they're saying now is not adding up to what happened in the past so i i believe it's fair to say that based on what their followers are saying they are tired of being deceived they need something raw they need something authentic they need something entertaining the family used to give all of that but they have lost the focus because they're so money driven money hungry that they're so focused on the money that the reality tv series is not delivering as it once would and it's time for them to throw in the towel but honestly i think they, they should not just throw that towel in i think they need to step on it and get rid of the show right because if if i can tell based on public responses that people are not being entertained it means that they're just dragging this dead horse because it is what made them famous and if it doesn't exist i believe they they believe that no one is going to remember them and this is where they failed with promoting themselves positively as a family because if you really look at it when you think of kim what is kim known for drama right subliminals plastic surgery crying about kanye saying kanye is gonna stalk her but only to see kanye getting married and not remembering her <laughs> listen guys sometimes it is messy but it's just exactly as it is because we know that december 28 kim was crying about you know i'm free but i'm scared to move on i'm scared to date but then Ye was already married to Bianca said sorry. So Ye popped up two days later with his wife. And then Kim's entire lies were revealed. She cried about this man being a horrible father, right? People say she didn't say Ye is a horrible father. But let's be honest. If you're going to say that you remember having the greatest memories with your dad, aren't you saying that you have the greatest memories, but your kids are not getting to spend time with their dads so they will not have the greatest memories listen we're not stupid and we're not slow we know how to read between the lines and when someone says something indirectly we definitely get what they're getting at okay so what i'm saying is that the kardashian jenners they had a, they had an opportunity to do something else but i believe that because the show made them so big they do not know how to survive without it courtney kardashian barker has long checked out of that family she has long checked out of that show and she has even said it to her siblings guys we are a lot happier 
when we're not filming. So what I believe they should have done is this. I believe that they should have dropped Keeping Up With The Kardashians on E! And I believe that everyone should have moved on to rebrand into their own reality TV series because that would have built more excitement. If Chloe had her individual reality TV series with just her circle of friends showing up and her family occasionally showing up, that will build more traction. More people would want to see that. And if Kendall and Kylie moved on to build their reality TV show together with their you know, family occasionally, occasionally showing up in that, people would want to see that. Kim just the same. People would want to see what Kim is doing with the kids. How much is she complaining about Ye? With her talking about Pete Davidson, Big DE, Energy and all. People want to see those things. But at this point together, the family is not delivering. And I believe that if they should go their separate ways and keep on doing reality TV series, it will definitely pique people's interest. Even though some ratings are going to be a lot more than some but i believe that chris jenner the mom i believe that if chris jenner has a reality tv series by herself that would be fire because she's more entertaining than many of her daughters and we would want to see courtney and travis in their family life without kim without chris without kendall without chloe we want to see courtney and Travis Barker with Alabama Barker, Penelope. We want to see that. Just get rid of the Kardashians because your fans are saying they have tapped out. You guys can reinvent, rebrand, come back and still capture the audience even better than before. But that's my opinion, okay? That's my opinion. I want to hear from you guys. Let me know what your thoughts are. And while you're at it, give this video a big thumbs up. Thanks for your time. Stay safe, stay blessed. See you all next time. Bye, guys.